she gon' big little legs. Skinny kid with plenty. Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's Zite. AKA Lil Red, we got the Denver Nuggets versus Miami Heat NBA Finals Game 2. Before we get started, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications so you do not miss out. This was a crazy game. Let's get into it. Struce coming out after that 0 for 10 game and went crazy in the first half. And down, man, down. Mitty for Gabe Vincent. Vincent snakes in and out, pull up, Mitty. Jamal wanting an offensive foul. Post up, Jokic over and power and bully him. Double team coming and down. Burn down. It's like the Nuggets thought that he just can't shoot because of game one. It's like they didn't know about Max Drew. Coast to coast, corner, KC3. Caldwell Pope, back door. Oh my God. You know Jokic is going to find that. Man out of bio. Has he pull up? Mitty. Rattled in right over Jokic. Gordon. Attack mode. They got Kevin Love to stop him now, but hand down. Man down for Jokic. They got that brush screen switch. Corner three. They kept going to that switch. Trying to get uh, Struis open. We got a Jimmy Butler rip through baseline drive. Floater over him. Off ball for Jokic. Two dribble pick up over Kevin Love. That's tough. I like Kevin Love in the starting lineup. I thought they were going to do it next game, but they went ahead and did it this game. I'm happy it didn't take that long to adjust. Porter for three. He kind of had a rough game. Struess. And down. And down. Deep. Dribble handoff. Murray. Back it up. Give it to Jokic. Fire it in his nostril. That man, Cody Zeller, just got embarrassed by Jokic this game. Hey, Bruce Brown. The Heat up got off to a good start. But the Nuggets came back. Look at Jokic. All right, over Zeller. That is a tough shot. This is not an easy shot. Look at this, man. On the run. Throwing it up with the right hand. Scramble offense. Brown thought about it. And he takes it all the way. He should have shot that, to be honest. Caleb Martin. Has he out? La I mean, Lowry. In his nostril. Uh, Brown out. Brown three. Those two right there came in and sparked some energy. I'm not gonna lie. Christian Brown and Bruce Brown's defense was crazy, especially on Duncan Robinson early. Jeff Green. Oh my goodness. Yeah, Denver went on a huge run. Here's Bruce Brown with a steal transition. Nuggets transition offense is incredible, bro. Damn, Jamal Murray for three. Christian Brown in and out corner three. Aaron Gordon's hitting threes. Struess one more to Vincent to shut it up in his nostril. Quiet that run. And here come the Heat. Quietly coming back, but no. Jamal Murray all the way. Damn. One. And he didn't go up with no. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. You, can, you see Struess say, hey, my bad. Jamal said, no, I don't care. I'm disrespectful. And hit him with a smirk. Jamal. Turn around. Kobe. Huh? I seen a tweet saying he's he's got Mamba mentality here. I can see it. Jimmy Butler in the corner. Good pass. Damn, bro. Their transition offense is beautiful. That's why the Heat can't miss shots and they can't get turnovers. Love. Fly by three. Stolen. Gabe Vincent all the way down one. Gabe Vincent, the undrafted point guard. Give it up. Three dribbles. Blocked by Bam, but look at that. You just can't stop him. You just can't stop him. They got this ISO for Jimmy. Listen, bro. I'm not going to lie. They stopped going to this uh, uh, in game one because they've been doing it against the Celtics. They got the ISO. Everybody on this side, uh, Struz just... Uh, tried to get a brush screen, I'm pretty sure. So he's still here, but he's clearing out. So it's just a clear out for Jimmy Butler. He just the spin move and then the pivot up. Beautiful. Jimmy Butler. Also, something about Jimmy Butler that I've seen this whole game that I was getting frustrated with. Right here, do you take this shot, bro? Like, he, Jokic was giving him this shot the entire game. Just the one dribble pull off off a of screen. See how much he's dropping on Jimmy? But Jimmy is the type of dude 
who wants to keep moving, keep moving, and get the defense to shift so he can get his teammates uh -huh. open. Butler searching. Jokic on him. <laughs> he turned down that easy one dribble pull up for that tough fadeaway. Here comes the Jokic. Oh my God. Uh, this is a crazy play, bro. Like all in one motion, looking like Lonzo Ball. Uh, woo. That's a good catch and finish, too. Jokic is crazy, bro. Jimmy rejecting the screen. Two dribble. Give it up. Vincent. Three. Vincent, another three pointer. He's got 15 points. KCP baseline drive. Lava. Hey. Struce. Pump fake. One dribble. Bam. Hey, reverse. Got smacked in the chin. Jokic wants the bully. Oh, my God. Hit him with the shimmy. <laughs> and down and down i like this little play right here it's like a little double screen the heat do this constantly when they have shooters like Struce or duncan robinson in the game they try to get these little switches and brush screens just so the defense reacts to it and then they include a shooter like kevin love a big man like kevin love into this look how confusing this is right here Caldwell Pope, and then they got another guy screening for Struess, and then everybody's worried about Struess. Nobody, nobody guards Kevin Love. Beautiful. Jamal, around the screen, back. Jokic thought about it, pull it, three. Damn. Jimmy, snakes in and out, baseline drive, found him, hand down. Man down. I told you, Jimmy Butler just wants to snake in and out until he finds somebody open. He prefers that over his jump shot. Good pass. Woo! Dave I mean, Dave Vincent. Bam at a bio. This is exactly the Miami offense, like, portrayed beautifully in this possession. Like, a dribble handoff. Bam at a bio is one of the best underrated playmakers as a big man, bro. Dribble handoff. Such a good shooter. Jokic's got to step up. One dribble pocket pass. Easy. Rotation comes. Bam can easily make this baseline pass by Jimmy Butler. This is the Heat's offense that I love so much. And even if they, if he helps off, you got Gabe Vincent. You got a pin down screen or uh, off ball screen for Kevin Love to set Jamal up. But look at this finish by Bam out of bio. I like the Heat's offense, man. I'm not going to lie. They put a lot of pressure on Jokic defensively. Floater. Okay. Bruce Brown all the way. Block. Got it back. Give it up. Jokic. Spin move. <laughs> you just can't stop it, bro. It's Jokic. Hey, good pass. Hook pass. Floater. Bam at a bio. I saw Michael Malone talking crazy about him last game. He came out and did his thing. Look at Zeller, the one highlight of the game. Because, yeah, here it is. Here's the moment this man, Zeller, just got embarrassed. And I don't think we'll see no more of Cody Zeller. Maybe uh, Haywood Highsmith. More Kevin Love. Shit. Maybe even your seven. Because damn, Zeller cannot guard Jokic. They try to use him as the Jokic stopper. They try to do one-on-one -on -one coverage with Jokic and Zeller. It's not going to work. Jokic got like 50 strength on him. Come on now. And down. Burn down. They went back to the same set. The pick and roll with Lowry involving Jokic. Because Jokic don't want to step up. Damn, boy. Jokic. Bullying Cody Zeller. Zeller losing the damn ball. Look at this. Coast to coast. Rumbling, tumbling. Oh, my goodness. That man, Jokic. Hey, give it up. One more. Duncan, pump, fake, fly by one, dribble, three. My favorite player on the Miami Heat. Duncan Robinson reminds me of me. This is how I play. Look at him attacking. Damn, one. And hand down. Bam. Down. Come on. Put some respect on Duncan Robinson's name, bro. Come on, man.
He wouldn't even get minutes in the regular season. Everybody was clowning him because he had that huge contract and he comes out here in the playoffs and just shows out and he's doing it in the finals. He's not afraid of the moment. Here comes this little off ball. Gabe Vincent and, and Duncan Robinson. It was working. Three for three, all here to start. Because look, so worried about Duncan because he's hot and ooh, ooh, he left another shooter. Three, Vincent. Same play this time and this time they don't help off Duncan and he finishes. Oh, 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 oh. That man, Jokic. Hit him with the behind the back wrap. The pocket pass, tough shot. Bro, Bam's pull up mid range is nice too. Bam is such a good uh, playmaker off that roll in the mid range. Especially, that's, that's going to be tough for Jokic. Look at that shot by Jimmy Butler. Jamal, tough. Six minutes, pocket pass, play make, out to Jimmy, pump fake, fly by floater, yes sir, no, one, Jimmy Buckets, oh, hey, got him leading, hook shot, I saw that Caleb, and down, foul, and a lot of people don't, don't want to say it's a foul, but it was a foul, I saw the replay, he makes all three, Kyle Lowry, pocket pass, boom, boom, one. This is the play. This is the lineup that's going to have the most success for the Miami Heat. This set right here, bro. I'm telling you, it's not even a set. It's just a simple pick and roll. We got Duncan Robinson and Kayla Martin in just for shooting. You got Jimmy Buckets in for that cut or the spot up three when Bam gets this. It's, there's so many counters and reads to this. You put Jokic in the pick and roll. Kyle Lowry is the best point guard, come off one dribble, pull up three point shooter on the Miami Heat, in my opinion. Although Gabe Vincent is very good too. It's easy. One dribble, he could pull this if he drops. So Jokic got to step up. Simple pocket pass. If he rotates, it's to Jimmy. If he rotates, it's to Caleb. If he rotates and he helps, it's to Duncan. And if they don't, it's Bam out of bio. Unguardable. Unguardable. Everybody was talking about Jokic in that pick and roll. Put him in the pick and roll. Why is nobody doing it? And now they're showing it. And this play right here, a lot of people want to say it might be goaltending. And it might be. But I'm not going to lie. I'm not mad. Because the Nuggets got away with so much goaltending. And they got them damn calls against or for them versus the Lakers. When Anthony Davis was getting blocks and they were calling it goaltending. Or when Michael Porter Jr. got a block in L.A. and they didn't call goaltending. So I'm not mad that it wasn't called goaltending. It's just the basketball gods giving you guys your karma for what you have done to them. And I'm not going to lie, I'm not trying to go off on Denver right now, but damn, they get mad when they don't get a foul call, bro. Like, they act like the whole damn world is, like, supposed to give them a ring. It's the Miami Heat. They're not going to let you, they're not going to let you get this ring easily. Come on now. They're gonna make you fight for it. Let's see if let's see if Denver's got that fight in them. Murray, give it up. Jokic. Butler. Butler. Tough shot. Got it right back. Butler out. Caleb. And down. Man down. But Gordon. Three answers. It's not over. Jamal Murray. And down. Man down. Huh? Jimmy Butler, one dribble, pull up, finally. He waited the whole damn game to shoot that shot. I just don't get it. I know he's trying to get his teammates confident. Maybe it's, he knows better than me. You know, he got to get his teammates involved so they start playing defense better. He, he's smart. A lot of players, a lot of former players, media, get mad at Jimmy Butler throughout the game. Like, bro, be aggressive. And this is all he needs to do. One dribble pull up. It's been open the whole game. Jokic drops way too far on him. He dares him to take this shot. Jimmy, confident. One dribble pull up in his nostril. Keep doing that, Jimmy. Next game, be aggressive. The passes will open up even more. Jokic missing it. Bruce Brown. He's got that shot. That floater in the lane is 100% for Bruce Brown. Caldwell, pull! Oh, he's looking like when he was on the Lakers. Not going to lie. That looks like him. But Jamal. Woo-hoo! 11-2 run by Denver. Uh...
That man, Jamal Murray, is not scared of any moment. At 1-1-1 in the fourth quarter, is going to hit a clutch three. Jimmy. Bam. Pump fake. Foul. Bam. At the free throw line. Easy. Jokic. Too easy. Way too easy. He's so good, bro. Jimmy. Step back. Three for the dagger. Missed it. Jamal Murray, three seconds, step it back and miss. And the Miami Heat win game two. Come on, man. Come on. Miami Heat come back and win game two. Eight-man rotation for Denver. And I'm not going to lie. Bruce Brown and Christian Brown gave them some good minutes. Three steals, two, five steals combined by both of them. And they were scoring. Jeff Green had nine off the bench. Jokic, 16 for 28. 41 points, but he only had four assists. Five turnovers for Nikola. 11 rebounds. Michael Porter Jr., rough game shooting again. One for six for three. 12 points for Aaron Gordon and Jamal Murray, seven for 15. 10 assists and 18 points for Jamal. For the Miami Heat, look at this big rotation. Pretty much everybody's getting minutes except for the three. We know he's not going to get no minutes unless it's a blowout. Kyle Lowry, 24 minutes, nine points, three assists, two threes. I'm telling you, they just need him for those threes to, to honor that drop coverage that Jokic is playing, to make him second question it. Colt, uh, Kayla Martin, 21 minutes, only three points, but he, that three points was clutch at the end. Five rebounds for him. Cody Zeller probably not going to do a damn thing next game. We'll see. He didn't do anything besides score four points. Gabe Vincent, 23 points, 8 for 12. The free agent. Upcoming free agent. Two steals, three assists, one turnover. Max Strews, four threes. Pretty much all in the first half almost, it felt like. 21 for Bam. Four assists, nine rebounds, 8 for 14. Beautiful game by Bam. And he's going to cook this series, bro. They're, they're playing right into Bam's specialty. Jimmy Butler, nine assists. Like I said, he's getting people open. Credit him for getting Max Struess open. Credit him for getting uh, Gabe Vincent open. And don't worry, he'll get Caleb Martin open soon. But he did 21 points on 7 for 19 shooting. Kevin Love came in, got 10 rebounds. 10 rebounds, an assist, two steals, and six points. We got the final four minutes right here. Go in and tune into this a little bit because, damn, that man Jamal Murray started going crazy. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Just watching Denver this whole damn playoffs, I thought they were going to make a comeback. And also, this is their first time they've lost at home in the entire playoffs. It's not easy to beat them at home. That, that's that dribble pull-up I'm talking about. he got to take that more, bro. Throughout the game. I know he's trying to get his teammates involved, but sometimes you got to take it. I feel like he's in the mode of passing too much. It's not a bad idea. It won him the game, so. Playing this zone defense. Jokic got a miss. Bruce Brown's just everywhere. Playing crunch time minutes. Looked like they went away from Michael Porter Jr. at the end. Denver, you can't trade baskets. You got to find a way to get stops. Down by six. Butler taking his time. 21 points, nine Trying to get that switch. They did get it. Now they got Jamal on him. So they're going to ISO to the side. Good defense. Duncan Robinson for the dagger. Missed it. They couldn't get it. So then they take Dun Duncan Robinson out. Not because of that shot. You already see there was a guy subbing in. Gabe Vincent coming in. And Duncan Robinson gave them some beautiful minutes in the third and fourth quarter, bro. Shout out Duncan Robinson. This zone is so interesting to me. This zone is so interesting to me. What is this? It's a one... A one... One, one, two, one zone. Or Two, two, one. I don't even know what it is. It's it's very unique. Very unique. I like it. It works. It gives the Nuggets some problems. They start missing shots. They think a little bit too much. 
Caldwell had a wide open shot and missed it. But Jokic did his thing. Got a clutch rebound. Give it to Jamal and he's going to pull it. We can test. You got to close out on that harder, Jimmy Butler. I like how they got Kyle Lowry at the end of the game, too. Cause just because he has a championship. He's not nervous. You could tell he looks confident and calm, composed. But so does Jimmy when he has the ball at the end of the game. Oh, oh, bam. Hard foul. They had to. No choice. No choice. Good foul by Caldwell Pope. Force him to take tough free throws. Well, terrific. Second shot against the vulnerable, smaller Gabe That's such a good Butler rebound by Jokic, bro. You got to contest harder if you're Jimmy Butler, to be honest. And guess what? Tyler Hero's back for next game in Miami, too. That's going to be tough. Two free throws, and Miami's going to go back into man this next possession. Adebayo, three for three from the line. The Heat, 16 of 18. 8 for 14, 19 and 9 with 4 6. Beautiful game for me, bro. Not even nervous at the line, bro. Denver is not an easy place to play in. Not even just because the altitude is loud, bro. Reminds me of like a Utah environment. I don't like Denver. I don't know why. I don't like their fans and their environment, bro. I don't know why. Like, I like their players. They're just, their fans. Not, there's nothing wrong with their fans. Like, literally nothing. It's just not my vibe. You know, Colorado's not my vibe. I know people that live in Colorado, I visited there. It's not my vibe there. But I'm not, I'm not a hater on Denver. I kind of, you know, I, they have such a good team. Their fans are not toxic. Just not my, you know, it's not my thing. Jokic got a switch. Yeah, they're making them work for twos. Give it to Jimmy. That's what I noticed about this too. Just the little things right here for uh, the Heat. Like Caleb looks like he don't want the ball. Vincent's like I don't want the ball. Just give it to the leader. The Heat got a leader no matter how bad he shoots. He's in control at the end of the game. Jamal's helping off Gabe Vincent. Oh, tough. Give it up. One more. Step back three. That's a good look. Woo. And I like how they let him play right here. It was exciting. And this is a good shot for Jamal. Woo. I thought they were going to foul. I thought this was in. Oh, so close. And you live with that shot if you're Denver because that man Jamal Murray did his. He hits those. He hit the two before that to give you guys a chance. <sighs> Crazy game, man. I don't think there's any interviews out because I did this right after the game. Let me know how you guys are feeling. Going back to Miami. Tyler Hero coming back. First team to beat Denver at home in the entire playoffs. Series is tied 1-1 when everybody's counting the heat out. They, everybody's talking about a sweep. Everybody's talking about boring finals. But I hope maybe some fans watch today's game and realize, okay, maybe it's it's not the Lakers and Celtics and it's not the narratives that the NBA tries to sell. But basketball is cool. I hope somebody saw that today. Because damn, this is a damn good finals, bro. I don't care what anybody says. 17 for 35 for 3 for Miami. They shot a lot better this game, and that's the reason they won. Let me know how you guys feel down below in the comments. This is Zite. Peace.